2021, presented by Window World. I'm Martin Anderson from WNCW. We're down at another community college. It's a Spindale and Isothermal Community College. We play a lot of Merle Fest acts, and uh, we also run WSIF, which is up here in Greater Wilkesboro. We cover Wilkesboro, North Wilkesboro, and Moravian Falls with our 90.9 .9 signal, bringing you the Merle Fest coverage throughout this weekend, 90.9. .9. I want to thank some of our sponsors for Merle Fest, Raymer Oil, Renewable Energy Design Group, and Rock Creek IGA Marketplace, Run In, the Santa Cruz Guitar Company, SE Systems doing the great sound here all weekend. Thank you, SE Systems. Also, ShopBot Tools and Shub Capos. We're ready for a good North Carolina act, and I want to introduce someone else to you here. He is a Reed Wilson. He is the secretary of the North Carolina Department of Natural and Cultural Resources. They are our program sponsor today here at Merle Fest. Reed's a big fan of Balsam Range. Make him welcome here, Reed. Woo! Thank you. Wow, it is wonderful to see all of you here tonight. Uh, the Department of Natural and Cultural Resources takes care of North Carolina treasures literally from A to Z. Arts, zoo, and just about everything in between. The symphony, our parks, our state library, our historic sites, science museum, history museums. We go on and on. We are engaged with North Carolinians every single day. Uh, we feel like we're the department of people, department of things people love about North Carolina. We are indeed a proud sponsor of Merle Fest, and our Come Here and See initiative is, uh, grew out of our Arts Council and it's something we are promoting throughout North Carolina to highlight the amazing North Carolina musicians who have made so many contributions to all uh, musical genres uh, that exist. Um, and tonight, uh, I want to say we all need live music. We all love live music. It makes us want to sing makes us want to dance, <laughs> makes us want to clap, it lifts our spirits. So we've all got to do our part to keep live music going, and to do that, we've got to beat this awful pandemic. And to do that, we need to get more people getting shots in their arms. We need to care for one another. We need to look out for one another. So do, if you're not yet vaccinated, just do it for live music. You know you love it. And if you have been vaccinated, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Now, I am a huge fan of Balsam Range. Five years ago, five years ago, I actually introduced them at a performance in Durham, uh, a different job I used to have. Uh, I got the t-shirt on from that day. See, fellas? Got it on. All right. Um, they are an amazing band. They're from Haywood County. Um, there you go. And Hay Haywood County's been hard hit by the Tropical Depression Fred, and so our hearts go out to the people in Haywood County. It's been really tough. Um, you all are here because you know their music, you love their music. They have released eight critically acclaimed albums. They have won 13 awards from the International Bluegrass Music Association, including 2018 Entertainer of the Year. They are up for the very same award in a couple weeks. Uh, so we got our fingers crossed for them. Um, so without further ado, I want to welcome, and I want you all to give a warm welcome to the one and only Balsam Range. 